Welcome to another Singularity of the Day. I'll start this out by asking you a question. How many sketch points do you see on this part? Well, if your eyes are really good, you would see eight. Of course, you weren't able to, or weren't easily able to see these sketch points because they were of a very similar color to the part that we're working with. Now to overcome this, of course I could change the color of the part, but I want to answer the question, how do I change the color of these sketches? There is a system level option I want to talk about, and also how to change the individual colors of the individual sketches. First, let's take a look at that system option. We'll go into options, colors, and then sketch inactive. So here's where I can change the color of that system level. So I'll keep this at gray for now, that's fine. And there's one system option to turn off to be able to see these specific colors. So to do this, I'll go into line format, turn on that toolbar, and turn off color display mode. With this option on, it's overriding any colors with that system status color that we took a look at in the system options. So turning that off, you can see that I've already done this for one of my sketches. It's red, very easy to identify. So how do I change the color of sketch two? Well, with it selected, I can go to that line format toolbar and change the line color. One other way to do this is right click on the sketch and choose sketch color. Here we have a property manager that we can choose from and also control the configuration and display state that it associates to. So hopefully this helps you work with colors with multiple sketches to clearly identify your sketches from geometry and also uniquely apply colors to help communicate different ideas about your design. Have a great day.